members thank Connex for the support that they provided us with the contract uh, negotiation. It, it's been like, really useful uh, for us. We were just like six or seven people in the team uh, and we had to, to assess a project that was done by hundreds of consultants and, and we had three months to assess what they did in 15 years. So it was a very challenging task what we had and, and that's, that's why we, we always think that Connex helped us quite a lot. And yeah, that's, that is basically what we had to do. We have to approve or not approve the, the project, right? And we as a government always want to make decisions, like very technical decisions that can provide the better for the people. So it was a very challenging decision that we had to make and the help we, we received from Connex was very helpful. We had, a, as I said, a, a big mining project and we needed help with the geomechanics, with hydrogeology, with financial modeling and, and, and some social aspects. So that was the help we, we received. It was just in those four topics. But as I said, when you open the, the study that was given to the government by the, the company, you could see that most of the reports were signed by consultants that like the authors of the books that everybody reads. So when you are in front of a report like that, even if, if you think you are prepared, then you start doubting because like, oh, this is the person that I studied, that I learned from, and now I have to assess their work. So when you are in that position, just like, trust me, it's a very difficult position because the people you, you learn from, now you are like, in some sense, you are assessing them. So you start like getting confidence, right? You, you feel more confident and, and, and you sort of level the table off, right? Because, uh, well, I cannot say the name of the company, but what I can say is that company might easily have the same value as our annual budget as a government. So those are very big companies, right? They offered a great support, and this has been the case for the past two years. We negotiated uh, mining contracts in Senegal, and it was a very complex process. Max was able to give us a more technical overview, a more expert um, scope on negotiation. We're negotiating with people who are experts, people who are investors that have been working on these documents for years and years, and then they submit these documents to us, and we have to analyze them. And sometimes the, the balance is not fair, if you see what I mean, because they have much more information, much more background than us, and we want to make sure that we have the best results with these contracts and this is where Connex was really helpful. We had two main um, mining projects uh, with the help of experts. We, we received technical expertise, a re-evaluation of the documents that were submitted at the, um, the level of geology, or the geology of the soil, the resources, and we also received legal assistance. Uh, to interpret the texts, the conventions in the mining sector, because in this one specific case, we had a merger or an integration between two very complex projects. So it was an even more complicated um, project. And we received also a financial and a social economic analysis so that we could get results of uh, 
what was going to happen if the project was uh, happening. So I don't know, Thomas, if I had uh, if I have answered your question, but this is just to give you an overview of what happened with Connex, and we can then maybe talk about the results that we've reached thanks to this uh, support. And then I would like to talk also about the recommendations that we were uh, given. A verification of the information we got, it was about doing a kind of fact check. We had additional sources, uh, complementary sources, and this is why it was very important to check whether all the information we got was correct. And the experts we were able to draw on allowed us to do all of the groundwork, the footwork, so to say. They helped us do this technical evaluation and they even gave us access to data which our government didn't have access to. So this was very valuable. Thanks to Connex, we had a lot of technical information, even project information information and data, which we couldn't draw on, not even our government. Mm -hmm. We had a lack of income. We have been able to compensate a lack of income because of the vigilance of our financial and legal experts. We have been able to increase the um, state revenue. Uh, I think it was about um, 37 billion uh, francs. Uh, CFR. So if you convert it to euros, I think that would be with 20 million euros if I haven't converted it incorrectly. So um, this was additional income which we had for our state coffers. And um, this came on top of the initial income we had planned with this project. So this was a major benefit. Another aspect which that we have been able to um, build capacities in our teams. Capacity building has been an important aspect. Learning by doing is one of the basic methods. So it wasn't only about helping our teams to get better negotiating skills, but we've really worked on the practical case. Experts helped us during the negotiation phase on the spot during the practical phase and this is something that has been very important for us because we will go about negotiations in a different way in future in, in future we've seen that the yeah. negotiating team has to be well prepared needs to have all the legal and practical information to have a proper negotiations and to see eye to eye with the investors again to have better income for our state I yeah. think that the governments will always need assistance. We will always need expertise. Mm -hmm. And even if we have been able to develop our own know-how, but we are dealing with investors who have more resources and Absolutely. they have more means and they have huge study offices, study firms and consultants at their disposal. And if that means that the governments also need to have access to experts, high ranking firms to mm -hmm. help us with negotiations to see eye to eye and be on an equal footing. So even if we have yeah. been able to build our capacities and although we've benefited from this help, we still need help for future negotiations. Yeah. We will still need experts to back us up when we're dealing with investors and mm -hmm. um, especially cross-cutting expertise is something we need. What we've gotten from our partnership with Connex is that they have been able to come in and support in those three major pillars. So they've been able to offer financial, uh, specifically financial help where they bring people with a financial background, help us review models uh structure or even checks and CTV analysis, uh, so CTV analysis do all of that you have the legal part where they come with a, a law firm that helps you look at the contract identify areas where it, you know where it could be the risk on the government side uh drafting wise and then also as importantly on the technical side where you're looking at if it's an infrastructure project you're looking at uh the, the one example I have is for a ring road, you know, and it's a major infrastructure project that the government is taking on and Connex has been able to mm. come in and offer specific help on the technical side for that because uh, I think Santiago touched on it earlier, there's, in most governments you won't have the capacity, uh, the technical capacity that's equal to that in the private sector, you know. Um, so if one goes out and does a feasibility study uh, spends months or years with uh, lots of consultants behind it and brings that in front of you, you don't, you, you need 
as equal resources to review that and also question where there might be gaps and having people just with the capacity to do that and also be able to say, all right, once you come up, once you come up with maybe an issue, you have people who are, uh, who are their solution has on to help unlock it uh, and move the deal forward. On, on, on the government of Rwanda, we like to think, uh, we would like to think that we work like the private sector. So we try to work fast, as fast as possible, turn things around, decision making, approvals, you know, we, we we try and move as quickly as possible, you know, sometimes even uh, to the level even not faster than the private sector. So with that means you need the right people, uh, giving you the right information, looking at everything thoroughly from the uh, bottom up uh, to make sure that once you make the decision, you make the right decision and you've not maybe uh, left yeah. a government exposed. So this, uh, well, this is the work that I've done is just, you know, you have someone in your corner that provides you the capacity that, or even the information that you might not know or ordinarily have. Now, to, to get the same type of information or the same type of help, government would actually have to, have to go out and spend a lot of money. We still have a long way to go together with Connex. Um, I talked about one concrete project before, and we really hope that this was not the end of this process. We hope that this was just the first milestone on a long journey, and we hope that our country will be able to benefit from more support in the future. Thank you. You can get a lot of different programs and, and like international help, but they are not as quick as Connex, right? So, so mm. we had the perfect timing, I would say. So I, I would encourage, encourage other countries to not hesitate on, on, on contacting Phonix. Phonix has come in as a credible partner who has been able to advise government and add a lot of value uh, to, to deals as far as giving information. Uh, and some of the countries that were here, you know, some of the industries that are, that are growing, you don't have as much information as, as, as you'd like, you know, because they're not as fully as de uh, developed. And Connex comes in and gives you advice on how to de-risk such, uh, such projects, uh, also balance it from a private public perspective. So mm -hmm. the, the, if it is a mindset is always to maybe uh, huddle on the government side, opening up and having a partner like Connex who's, who will get you Help, but not only help, but also the right help is key because those are the people who make you overall uh, uh, for a, a better deal whereby the private sector is happy, the public sector is happy, and the country benefits as, as, as uh, overall. And also, uh, as, as, as the beauty about Connex is that it's not, it's not tied to maybe one specific industry or one specific uh, sector. Where they have expertise, mm -hmm. you know, they, mm -hmm. they, they they're able to open up to a whole wide range of sectors, a whole wide range of people with different skill sets, uh, with uh, that will come in and add value to the negotiation, add value to the final agreement.